Hey, I'm Liana. This is Tough Little Ranch on the Prairie, and I'm gonna show you uh, my daily chores that I go through. It's morning here. Uh, everybody's excited to be fed. I ran through, gave them a little bit of hay first, just because they are ridiculously hungry. As you can see, the cats are hungry. It's really, really windy outside right now, so you're not gonna be able to hear much once I go out there to feed the sheep, but we'll do the best we can. <laughs> blue shot We got some goats back here with the buck, hopefully getting bred so we can have some babies. pigs in here this is mango this is a mangalisa that's Wilma I should add my feed buckets pre-filled here, make it go a little quicker. I just have a mix of oats, corn, um, goat pellets, beet pulp. I get that pre-mix from a local guy here. Sunflowers, black sunflowers in there. These are the young girls. There's a couple weathers in here as well. This is a creep feeder for them so that the babies can get feed um, and the moms don't push them off the feed. Makes them a little, little easier for the babies to put weight on just so they don't have as much competition. And these guys are hungry. Come on girls, let's go outside. I just make sure I spread the feed out because some of the goats get picked on. Um, they're just like any other animal. They gotta figure out who the boss is. So somebody has to be in charge. So whoever's in charge pushes the weaker ones out of the feed. And before I put feed in these, I gotta make sure the pans are clean.
goats are very curious animals so they like to step in and lay in crawl over everything that they possibly can as you can see all right now i just got to fill the rest of their feeders with hay like that one is i already did water just because it's not that easy to maneuver a five gallon pail of water when you're trying to also shoot a video so probably got about 50 head of goats um in the past i've bred them all to kid just put the buck in the pen let them all kid at the same time but i found that it's a lot easier to spread them out then you don't have to worry about all the babies at one time so that's why we got that small pen in the back with just a few goats in with the buck I just got a small square bale here putting hay into the little feeders this is one of the last babies that was born her and her sister were in oops buck jumped the fence and uh, so we got a couple babies that were a little bit unexpected middle of summer So all I'm going to do here is finish filling these feeders with hay and uh, that's basically all I have for this the main barn uh, for chores this morning. So we'll post another video of the other stuff we got to do.